King Charles gave his first Christmas address on Sunday 25th December. In a video shared on the British royal family's YouTube channel, the 74-year-old monarch mentioned his late mother, Queen Elizabeth II, and paid tribute to Prince William and the Princess. Kate Middleton's work as a royal. I stand here in this exquisite St. George's Chapel in Windsor Castle, so close to where my loving mother, the late Queen, rests with my dear father, he began, the first donation from a male monarch in nearly 70 years. He continued, recalling the heartbreaking letters, cards and messages so many of you have sent to my wife, I cannot thank you enough for the love and concern you have shown to our entire family have brought. The king added. Christmas is a particularly touching time for all of us who have lost loved ones. We miss them at every family change of season and remember them at every tradition cherished. He later praised William and Kate, saying. The Prince and Princess of Wales recently visited Wales and shed light on practical examples of this community spirit. Images of the new Prince and Princess of Wales have been reproduced from the 40-year-old Duke and Duchess's public outings. As King Charles continued to express his gratitude to soldiers, medical workers and teachers, among others, for their service, people noted that two notable names were omitted from his speech. King Charles appeared to snub Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, amid rising tensions between the couple and the firm, following the release of Harry and Meghan. In the finale of the Netflix documentary series, Harry said he had a hard time meeting Charles and Prince William for his grandfather Prince Philip's funeral in April 2021. It was tough. Most of all hanging out and having conversations with my brother and my dad, the Duke of Sussex shared. They were very focused on the same misinterpretation of the whole situation. Neither of us really wanted to talk about it at my grandfather's funeral, but we did.